Hey everyone, today in this video we are going to create this type of cinematic title intro in Filmora. Very easy and fun to create. You can even find other cinematic intro tutorials on my channel. Please check them out. Now let's start today's video. First go to the track manager and add 10 video tracks. Then place the background image on track 1 and make it 4 seconds long. Then go to the stock media. Place the black solid color on track 2 and make it 4 seconds long. Then from the mask select the circle mask. Adjust the scale accordingly. Go down and invert the mask and increase the blur strength. Also you can use search bar in each section to search the effects, filters, stickers, templates and titles. Just enter your word like in titles enter. Mood social media to get the title for social media. Happy yellow. Grunge metal production. And so on. To create a big night effect, then go to the stickers, search for shatter glass and apply the shatter glass on track 3. You can choose any shatter glass of your choice. Trim a few starting frames and place it from the start. Then adjust the position and place the shatter glass on the left lower corner and make it 4 seconds long. Then duplicate the shattered glass, increase the scale to 135, rotate it by minus 22 and place it on the right upper corner. Then search for cinematic background in stickers and you will get lots of options to work with. Place the background of your choice on track 5, make it 4 seconds long, then change the blend mode to linear dodge. To make the background much darker, you can adjust the mask on black color to get the desired result. Now select all the clips, right click and create a compound clip. Then place the playhead at the start and change the scale to 200 on the keyframe. Then after 10 frames, change the scale to 110 and at the end, change the scale to 100. And our background is ready. To give it a bluish tone, go to the Filters tab and from the Camera folder apply G-Log Creative 1. Now go to the Titles and drop the default title on track 2, make it 4 seconds long, then from the Titles click on Advanced. Then add a new 3D title and remove the 2D title. Change the font size to 44 and change the font to any bold cinematic font. Link is in the description. Then enter your word and increase the letter spacing and adjust the word position. Then add another 3D title and enter your word. Then change the scale to 18 and place it above the main title. Then go to the preset and choose any preset of your choice and apply on both word. Then click on apply. Then go to the video Place the playhead at start, change the scale to 3000 and adjust the text position. Then on transform keyframe, reduce the opacity to 0 and on a keyframe. Then after 10 frames, change the opacity back to 100 and change the scale to 100 and reset the position. Then at the end, change the scale to 80 and our text animation is ready. Then place the text on track 6. Now to add the players, go to the sticker and search for player and you will get lots of options. Choose the player of your choice and place it on track 5. And on 10th frame, adjust the position on first letter of the main title and on position keyframe. Then at the start, take it out of the frame. Then at the end, change the scale to 80 and adjust the player position and place it on a center ladder and make it 4 seconds long. Drop the player one more time on track 4. On the 10th frame, place it below the last ladder and on the position keyframe. At the start, take it out of the frame. Then at 4 seconds, change the scale to 80 and adjust the player position and make it 4 seconds long. Then at the 5th frame, 
trim both the flare and make the fifth frame a start position. Even you can use opacity, set the opacity to 0 at the start, then at 10th frame set the opacity back to 100 on both players. Now to add an explosion, in sticker search for hot explosion, place hot explosion 4 on track 3 and change the speed to 1.5x. Now go to the basic and change the blend mode to hard light and you will get this type of explosion effect. Now search for Kung Fu Burst and place it on track 2 and trim 6 frames from the start then change the blend mode to screen and set the opacity value according to your need. Now go to the effects then go to the new blue FX folder then to the filters folder scroll down and apply a soft focus effect on top track and keep it for 8 frames only. Then at the start of the effect, change the blur value to 20 and at the end change the blur value to 0. Now to add shape, go to the shape folder in video effects, apply extreme effect on a top track at the 5th frame and keep it till 15th frame. Then apply the sharpen effect and then apply an auto enhance effect and then apply cinematic bar and set the bar to 0.05. Now to create further titles, duplicate the background clip, then duplicate the title and change the word. Then duplicate the flares and adjust the flares position on second and last keyframe. Then one by one copy all the clips and place them under the second title. Then copy the soft blur, copy the shake effect and extend the sharpen auto enhance and cinematic bar. Now to see the preview, render the project and you will get this. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more awesome tutorials. Also check out my other cinematic titles and cinematic intro in Filmora. See you guys in my next video.